Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how I would look if I was a shadow hunter from the new movie Mortal Instruments City of Bones which comes out on August 21st. So I've started with a completely bare face and the first thing I'm going to do is apply an eyeshadow primer. This is the Kat Von D one and I actually really really like it. Next I'm taking my face powder and just using that to set my eyeshadow primer so that way my eyeshadows are easier to blend. And then I took a dark cream liner and applied it to my eye and blended it out and I'm applying a kind of ashy, cindery colored eyeshadow to my lid. Now every eyeshadow that I'm using is from the Smashbox Eye Studio Pop Palette. Now I'm taking a medium brown eyeshadow and applying it to my crease and this is Faint from the Naked Basics Palette. Here I'm taking my bronzer and using that to blend out the faint color. Next I'm taking a gray eyeshadow called Smoke and putting it on the outer third of my eye. And then I'm taking a kind of sparkly black eyeshadow called Obsidian and placing it on the outer third of my eye and in my crease. And then I just cleaned up all the fallout and applied my foundation and concealer and powder as normal. Next I'm taking a black eyeliner. This is Zero from Urban Decay and I'm just using it to tight line my waterline and my tight line. And then I also put a little under my lash line. Next I'm taking a color called Lunar and applying that to my inner corner highlight and then I'm using Faint to blend out the black eyeliner and then I'm applying Cinder in the kind of in-between area between the Lunar and the Faint color. And of course I had to blend it out more. Next I'm just curling my lashes and applying a butt ton of mascara. I wear way too much mascara for my own good and I just went about putting on my normal mascara routine. Here I'm taking a blush from Estee Lauder called Cappuccine and I'm applying that to where I would normally contour and then I'm taking Faint and using that to kind of darken up the look. And for blush I am using my Briar Rose Beauty Powder from MAC. And for highlight I use the Wet n Wild Fergie Collection Rose Champagne Glow. Now for lips, I'm going to use the Revlon Kissable Balm Stain in Honey and actually my sister was behind me because she got burned at dance school today and I had, and she was just talking to me and chilling in my room. So now I am painting the runes that the Shadow Hunters have in the movie and I figured it would be really cool to just make it look like a shadow hunter so here I am painting the shadow hunter rune on my shoulder in a black cream liner this is actually the same cream liner that I used on the outer third of my eye and I went ahead and painted I believe three more runes no four more runes I painted the health rune like kind of in between my jaw and my neck which looks very much like the Evanescence logo if you guys remember what that looks like. And then I also painted strength on the side of my face because I thought that was going to be ironic because I am not strong at all. And I painted love on my chest. And then once I put on my jacket I noticed you guys couldn't see my Shadow Hunter rune so I had to repaint it on my hand.
And once you've painted all your runes, you get to put on a leather jacket, pose really gratuitously, and be finished with the look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching.